Yes, my people, I want to do. I'll say I don't shop. I'll say on a don, on a don, on a don, on a don. On a welcome, because this is on a part two of this video. Just sit down and relax. I'll say you don't bath, you don't make up, you don't rub your, your you don't paint your eyebrow and your, and your eyeshadow. How do they call the shadow there? So this one now, the cutting part and the sewing now, one doing one. So the part one, if in the case never wash her, go watch the part one. This part you never shown her yet. But don't worry, may your temper never hurt first. Just calm down, I will show her on time. I explain the reason why I know fit show this padding for now. That will not miss I go show, I'm not go show I'm no worry, just relax. If you never subscribe, subscribe. Eh? I beg, subscribe. So that other people, so that YouTube they will fit push this channel for other people then to see them. Come learn. You will say where you say if they learn. So what I want to show now how to sew this thing as they see and so so this is none of my list. After I don't cut them for the video when I get to cut, in case you never watch that video, I would advise me to go back to that video so that you can understand what I they do here. That video will help you well. So, this one on my side and this one on my front. And the center now I won't cut, now the front I won't cut too. And see my lining, this one on my lining, you see I'm, this one on my lining, maybe this so I don't put pad, but when I will show on how to pad the blouse, I believe that one I will put some mendement there for the line itself. This one not put any mendement there. Everything just there like steel, steel without meat for this lining. But you see sweet too. Even without meat itself, you fish up your your rice. Maybe so. So I think I want to show you how to cut this one. So after everything, as this center now, I don't part this center. So you know the fit allow me to fold them. Because I don't part them. And the thing I get here at the same center for my lining. And I cut my lining, everything for my lining at the same shape of my main fabric, which is my main material, at the same shape I do that. So I will use my lining for this part, take place for here. Then I will use my satin on my lining, anyone I want to use. Because I'm through my main material, I mean I take trace out my lining before I can pad them. You understand? So what I want to do now, this up now. For this up, people they like me this design they show. They like for glass, maybe this design they show you. They get one kind of fine look like that for this front. So say this place now gets mouth. So now the mouth is this. So if you want the design to show it, you go do now, you go raise your material come up for about two inches or one and a half. It depends because after everything, I go still cover out my neck that so let me say no. let me say two inches now let be this let's say i will still cover out my neck when i cut and so okay so now i four there now i see trim and brush like about seven so two inches depth like that from then i won't take start to shift and go up so after i don't place and like it because why are they shifting like because i want this my lace mouth to show i make a shift and like that I want my lace mark to show so that you find the front uh, If they look at you, they see how everything balanced. The every design as you show, you know how you be for blouse. So that one said be very important to so take note of that. That one said another secret. Some people fit no no. If they cut that up, they throw it based on saying uh, lace mark. That mark might be the design itself. Some lace them. This mark they come with very plenty of design. So if you so blouse, me you know say that mark is very important. So what they see me do now? They, arrange my fabric as they talk so i'm not just a shift shift material they arrange my fabric to make sure say yeah they arranged so maybe take note of that one so i try to put them in place before i start to cut so that i don't make any mistake uh -huh. so so uh, as we talk wait till i'll be tell yourself don't say with the shot as i arrange and so i don't want to play music for you i want to the sing song so they talk so they sing song i would say the film yeah. So I they arrange them like this now. So I arrange them finish so now so now so put it there. <laughs> no, I don't mind me also. I can't say the bill, the work. When the work don't do, I like say you don't drink. But I do now, I don't hide. I never drink over I don't hide. So after I don't arrange them like this now, everything I'll come to now, I'll come cut the shape out exactly like this. 
not take the life too serious. So if you say I see the play down on your matter, nothing that the life. If you carry on too serious down on your matter, that no consignment. I won't be saying if the reason I say I see the play, say me learn. If you follow me, you're not gonna learn anything. I say this guy to the play, this guy to the play. Nobody gonna live my life for me. Or... So they say that they do now. They, I want to trace exactly the same shape. The only thing when I do for the up now to reduce them by two inches so that my lace mouth fit appear for my main bust. You get they very important to arrange them like that. They very important to arrange. If it still extends more than that too, if you want them to show where, if you want them to show where, if you make them even three, if you make them even three inches. Yeah, so just like this now, so that they try to tell you what well, they tell you before. So this one on my okay. See my see my front. See my use and show you an example of it and I believe mean. Change the see um the see as the list marks come there. So this design now no can come up. Like I said, I can't keep this design up now. And I can't cut my neck. I've always this design. But as I can't bring and come down like this, the design can sit here. So if I cut my neck now, this design will still be show. I think I keep on like that. So now so it will be. Don't forget to subscribe or as it look like this. So, so that other people self go fit see. Thank you for that one. God bless you. So I'll go over to the back. The back that place no necessary matter for the back. No really matter. If you use the remaining design where you get for this time, take two for your sleeve. Or take design your cloth the way you could fit designer. If you use and take do your creativity, I mean, you want to hear like about this work because if it's do all kind design like that, you know. Yeah. So for the back, no necessary matter because the back you feel make a full. So that design we did for this down now. Now you know how you will take draw. Maybe I will use a take two for my sleeve. I never know yet. But when I've done the same book, I don't know how I'm waiting at the place where I'll place that down from. So, your bar will be full, though. very important. Your bar will be full. And I think that I will shoot a video on how you will take so your how you will take so your your lace for your satin when it will give you problem. Very easy. You will say everything with easy, you know, give you problem. So now this very material, me I want to shoot that video. So, so just watch because I'm not gonna show you how to do that one. That one, separate video. I don't want to waste plenty of your time because as they see, I'm so I don't say I don't waste time already. So I don't want to waste plenty of time. I want to make sure see I just go one time, one time, one time, one time, finish them so that this you will understand. I beg, don't vex say my video. They take time. Or in case the, the reason I say. The video too they long and because of say me i want to you understand though let me say i know if you make a short but if you make a short but i will skip so many things when i suppose to explain give you i will skip just because of say i want the thing to short you understand you go fit savvy but not be all the detailed things there you go fit say the detail but you get some kind areas there will be say just because of say i want in fact i will just tell you say i will go like this one like this yeah i will go cut out you know, go see how they go online. So, just no vex. Now, if you tell you, no vex, I beg. I beg you. So, as it be so, I don't cut my. I don't cut out the lace out from the. Um, I don't use the satin cut out my lace. So, what I go do next now, now to shoot that video as I tell you. So, after that video, I will continue from where I stop. Then, I will tell you what to do next. So, just relax. So as they be so, I don't choose the video as I tell on now. I don't do them. I wanna see how they be. If you never see that video, you need to watch them. They see how they be everywhere. Just they clean, clean like say na new, a new car. Say just by clean. No any error. Not like say they gather. You know they give you any gather. Very clean. They see how they be. And so if you follow that way, when I show you for the video, if you never watch the video. 
reminds me in case I never drop, I will drop the link for you to go watch the video. Yeah, what you go do now? Go trim all the rough edges. Just the way you cut your lace, come so on. When you get lace, the way they come out. So that when you want so, you know, it will give you a problem. So what I will do now, we'll trim out there. I will take all my pins there. Make I do all those ones. They make my clothing neat. They might come back. Come show. Now see what I will do after that one. So I don't come out my pin them and I don't trim everywhere. So as they see, I'm not everywhere. They need. So what I can do after I don't come out my pin, I have to go sew them. And if I want to sew this thing, it is very easy to sew. For me, you take note of this place. So this one on my under bust where my pad starts from. So this other one where the pad starts from to now your under bust. So what I go do now I will make sure say these two lines where come like this meet up each other. I will make sure say these two lines where come like this meet up each other. Then what I go do I go sew for about two inches. Start from about two inches. So half inch enter half inch until so go reach it up. Remember when with the cotton, if you never watch that video, when I the cotton, I keep half inch for sewing allowance. So maybe the work for this one now where you go do half inch now you go sew for your sewing allowance. Go this end from that your two inches so did there. So then this the same one again, the same thing where you do for what I show you for the other one, and the same thing where you go do for this one, the same two inches, half inch, you so go reach the end. Then if you don't sew reach that end from here, you can sew come down. Where you don't sew from here, go up from that place where it stops. So you can sew go down. The same thing I go do for this other side. Then for the back, I already shared the back into two. When I before so I go there easy for me to to sew the lace put together. So for the back, as the back did like this, so remember there's no cut or come out. So this thing I go help you make a day easy for you to sew. So what you go do for the back now? You go make sure say this down. They very equal. The English why I speak just now. I don't understand. Make sure say they equal. If not very safe, may they may they equal and so zero. Eh? So zero point five half inch. So half inch until we can reach here. Use your scissors. Open up. They sew and close. Do the same thing for the side. For this other side. Then do the same thing for your lining as I show you for both the front and the back. Do the same thing. So make I go sew on, then come back on show now. How it look like after all those ones then. So as today now, I don't join everything with half inch. If you remember when I did cut, I say everything, you all join a half, half inch. I don't join everything with half inch. I, I join them now for the main material. When I get here, you see and say I don't put small notch here. I notch them. The same thing, not sure courage this up. This other side say if I not sure, not sure small small courage is down. You see how you see how the distance we go now. So I not sure for the back. Say if I don't sew the same half inch for the back, and I not sure as well. Then for the lining, I not sure. Then I can't top stitch them. After I don't not sure stitch, I can't top can't run thread on top. Make sure I say in the face this side where really the top station. Make sure I say your material the face this side. I need the face center. I need the face come in the middle. The face go the side. Even the back self. I don't know sure. Then I can some face go the side for the back. So what I go do now now to iron them. As I tell you before, my iron. And I will use this ball. Take iron them. Very soon I'll show you how to make this ball. In case I don't know how to make this ball. I'll show you now. this ball I will just take iron there so that it go. Balance way, go smooth way. So make I go ahead, go iron now. What I iron and finish, I'll come show now. The other parts, then we on I will do. So just stay tuned. So I don't iron my my boss. So you, they see how they stand. They see how they look me. They see how they eye. They see how they see how the boss they stand. They open eye. I say your own good day. If you follow this way, I show you. So after like that, after I don't iron like you see as smooth everywhere you see like say the uh, express, see how it's smooth. So what I go do now my neck depth, my neck depth. If you you fit even take the neck depth from your client, some people like I make it go down, some like I make it go up. 
Maybe everybody be the same. So would they advise if you take where they say make you stop, make you don't make them too come up or it too go down. So for this person, what they do now, what I want to take them at seven, and be my neck there, so I want to keep them. So they see my hand, they see I see now this four inches when I come out. This four inches when I come out now, from there, and they start from, so they put them for my seven inches. Let I see if I fit, take them from this view. So from my four inches, so yeah, so this seven inches, now you stop. So this is my seven, now I will mark them like this seven for my neck depth. If you want your heart to go down, if you make her go down, you want to come up, if you make her come up, it depends on your clients, maybe even your choice, now your client will tell you how it will be. Then you connect them to this armor here. From this point, connect them to this point. So make I turn them this way. So from this point, I connect them to this point here. So everything I will do now, I'm three mom out. I'll trim them to that point just like this. So after I trim them to that point just like this, we'll get something like this. So you see as my neck door opens, you see as it be now. So the thing I will do after I don't trim out my front, I'll come place them for my for my back. I'll come place them for my back to cut out my back just like this. So for my back now, after I don't place my back, they see my zip allowance. I will make sure I keep my zip allowance the way I did follow since I did cut up till now. My zip allowance would be so you will choose a zip day there. So what thing I go do now, after I don't place them like this, I'll come draw my own shape for the back. Make sure I say this is your side day equal. So your back depends on how you want or how your client work rather. How your client work now you'll be work with maybe even how you want. So for the back, when the back go down, now they really come out well for your this thing. When the back go down, so me, I'll just make my back to go down small past my front, like one inch. Then I'll connect them from this point here. Then I'll connect them to that point when I bring them down from. So like one inch from my front, from my back, and the back depth, that is the deepness of the back, it be past my front, like one inch different, and take pass, so you see how it will be, so now so, so if you don't trim them out like this, what you will come get to do next now, now to trim out for your, this thing, your lining, so don't trim them out like you have to trim out for your lining, but well, before you trim out for your lining, you go check your zipper space like this now. You cross check if you did out two inches where they keep things. So if I check out like this now, say you come out only small thing for there, you come out for the two inches, but for here, space there. So I'll come and trim them. Make sure I say you know pass that two inches or here the trim. So if I say keep that two inches for here, here I know they necessary if you feel go ahead swam like that when you sew your zip you go swam well you will fall in place i'll still show you all those ones there so after i don't cut them like this what you go do now to cut my lining so what i will do now make i cut out my lining then i'll show you what you go do no worry look i just cut the lining so i guess what i want to show you if i don't full up like this if it confuse you so for you not to be really confused make i show you how it will be so I'll come cut my lining exactly the same shape for the neck like this. I'll just use this front section sure now and I'll do the back now the same way I do this front. You will follow through the back. So after I don't trim out my neck now, you know, say now my lining and my material don't they equal. I know if it be like this. So I will come minus like 0 0.7. No reach one inch or 0 0.7, no reach one inch or 0 0.7. Why are the commodities 0 0.7? The reason why you say this 0 0.7 why are the commodities now go feel make me so this lining in a way we be say you know go appear outside because if I make this lining equal with the main material, if I sew on in the lining will come outside because if they equal and after I don't sew the neck, come to you will come shift to the lining will come to show outside. 
and I don't want them to happen like that. So I reduce them by 0.7 inches. After I don't sew the neck and the down, everything will come go inside. So that's why I will take to the back. Make I do the back, finish the mark, come back to you. So after I don't cut the back now, so after I don't cut everything, so what you could do next, I to place them like this. Carry your lining, place the good side of your lining and the good side of your lace. You will place them together. You see the bad side. So what thing I go do now, I go sew half inch. Either you sew half inch or you no go reach half inch. So far you sew and make it seal this part. Sew and go reach up. Then you top stitch them. The way I top stitch this material, why I tell you so. You top stitch and your top stitch, you may top stitch for the lining, not be the main material. This for the night for the lining. Then this down says you go sew them from this end to this end. Then you top stitch them. If you don't top stitch and finish, you will come close this side and close this side. Do the same for your back. Your back, if you don't sew your back, right side to face right side. If you don't sew your neck for your back. Okay, so as you do like this now, if you don't sew your neck for your back, you will top stitch them. Sew this down, then top stitch them. Sew here, come down, close for the zip. Then sew here, close for the zip. Then turn them out. Then I go do all of them like that and turn them out. Then I will show you how I take down and top stitch as I tell on as well, and I will understand better. So I don't go sew them. I don't sew everywhere, both the neck and the down part. I don't top stitch them. If you look like this now, you will see and say, I don't top stitch this side. And I also top stitch the neck part so that when I the iron, you know, they struggle with the main material, you just relax. Because of that top stitching now, it will fall flat. Because of that top stitching now, it will fall flat. So I don't want anything to show like that. So even the back self, I top stitch the down and the upside, the neck. So what I will do next now, after I don't do all this one, I will iron them to make sure I say everything be flat. When I iron and finish, I will come back to show and I do. Okay, so I don't iron them as you see, so you see as they look neat now. I don't iron them. But this one on the back, the two back, so I don't iron them as well. So what I will do next, I will see fold my front again. Fold my front, place on top of my back. So as I fold down, put on top of my back. What I will do now, I will mark my zip line. Because here now where my zip will enter. So I will mark this my zip line like this. Now I can come down. Just follow the zip, the, the shape of your blouse like this. Now I can. Just mark it like this. Make sure say anytime they mark this your zip line. Make sure say where you go so you go see your shop the show. So when I go sew, I will sew from up, come down. I make I mark it like this so that my shop now the show. I will follow my exact shop. So come down. So when I go sew here, come. If I sew and come down, I will come open up, iron them, iron the opening and the front side. I'll show you how it look like about it. Uh, so I don't iron them as you see how like this one. So as I iron them, so when I want to fix my zip, I will let you know the reason why I done like this. So as you don't do like this now, I can't place my front on top of the back, just like this. So as I don't place it like this, I'll come pin them. Look, I go pin them, reach down the mark, show you what I will do next. As I don't pin everything like this, this I will do now, I can't get my measurements. So my boss now, now 35, I will divide them by 2. Now I'm not be into 4 again, I'm into 2, but I don't open them. Now only back and front. Let me open me this now. 35 divided by 2 will give me 17 and a half. So 17 and a half. Now I will mark here. So as I mark on here, what I get between here to this end, I will divide them by 2. So what I get here, I get 3 inches. So this 3 inches now, I will put 1 and a half here. 1 and a half here, I will and go up. Then here, put the same 1 and a half. Roll and go up. So I don't get like that for my waist. My waist now 29. 29 now I will divide them by 2. 29 divided by 2. Give me 14 and a half. So 14 and a half now I will mark them here. 
and I will do the same thing what I'll do for there. Which one I get from here to here? I get 4.2. So that 4.2 now divided by 2 will give me 2.1. So I put 2.1 here. Plus another 2.1 here. For my waistline. Then my hip. My hip now. 39. 39 for my hip. Divided by 2 will give me 39 divided by 2 will give me 19. 39 divided by 2 will give me 19 and half. 39 for my hip divided by 2 will give me 19 and half. So 19 and half. 3 inches like what we from this point to here and 3 inches. So I will put 1 and half here. And one and a half for here. Then I connect from this point. Uh, I connect and come down like this. Come it to the one and a half. And this other side itself, I connect them like this. Come it to the one and a half. Just like this. So what I will do now? I will just sew on like this. Come down. Then I turn on. If I sew on, I come down. I come iron here. Open. They are going to turn and show you how it looks like. Yeah, I don't go ahead. I don't iron this side as I tell you. I don't iron and open. I can't turn them like this. The front. I can't iron everywhere. So now everywhere they straight now. You see as you don't balance. So, so as you do like this now, what I will go and do now? My round shoulder. You need to take your round shoulder measurement. Your round shoulder measurement. So my round shoulder measurement when I get here now, now. 43. 43 now I get for my full round shoulder measurement. I'm going to divide them 43 by divided by 2. 43 divided by 2 now will give me 21 and half. So this 21 and half when I get now. Remember, I say my joining for my shoulder here will take 4 inches to join them for the extension. That 4 inches now, if I plus another 4 inches for the back, will make an 8. So let me say my joining for my side, for my sleeve, now 8. For my extension at eight, and remember, I say you could do like this one side you join for this front, and the other side will join for this back. Then they can be eight. So, what I will do now is I don't divide my eight divided by two now. What I get ten and four? What I get ten and four? So, this four, when I get ten now, are the same four when I get for this side. So, as I get my twenty-two and half, as I get my twenty, twenty-two and half now. Are we 21 and half? Sorry. So as I get my 21 and half now, what I go do now? I go minus this four when they end, and I'll see minus this four when we come enter for the sleeve for this side. So this 21 and half minus four minus eight now. Four plus four now that eight. I'll go minus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you can't give me 13 and a half. So my 13 and a half from this point when they end, so. I'll take my measurements from here, like this. Like this, get my 13 and a half. So my 13 and a half, what I get here now, I'll couple mark here. So as I put this mark here, what I get from here to here now, I will check. So what I get from here to here now, I can't get three and a half. So this three and a half now, if I want to divide this three and a half divided by two now, it will give me, three and a half divided by two now, will give me 1.7. So 1.7 now, I can't mark, 1.7 for here, so mark another 1.7 for this side. So as I mark my 1.7 for the both side, what I will do now, I will just draw my mark for my arm hole, come down like this. I'll draw, come down like this, then draw this other side, self, come down. If I draw, come down like that, then I'll come cut my arm hole out. I'll come cut my arm hole out like this. So as I can't cut them out like this, remember when you want to cut your sleeve, for your sleeve, you know, go make them four inches. You know, go make your sleeve for exact four inches. That four inches now you go join for this place. Your sleeve, you go add half inch to make them four and half. So that half inch, you go take join for this place to continue your sleeve. So 
I don't finish what I do now. I don't cut the ammo like I show now, like this. So, so I want to say thank you for now to stay rich this length. I don't know why they ship this thing go on herself. So I, I want to now thank you. Also, now understand what I just show now just now. I want to the camera rich cash. I show now. I want to say thank you for everything I don't stand rich this length. With time, I will see if you on how to cut your sleeve. But in case you don't do sleeve, or if you don't understand how to do your sleeve, you fit comments for the comment section. Tell me, say you know, Sabi do sleeve. Then I will use paper to explain to you how you do your sleeve. I see my show, I don't try, and I don't try, and I don't waste enough time. I know what's on around for now. Another day, I'll show on that one. But if you want to know how to do the sleeve, tell me for the comment section. I will you do paper illustration on how you will do your sleep. So thank you, man. I stay, stay safe and take care of yourself. Bye bye.